Is alcohol good for you or not? Well, let's see what the latest thinking is on this. We're checking out a report at Study Finds where we invite you to like and subscribe. Speaking of subscribing, if you're among the many who subscribe to the idea that a nightly glass of wine does wonders for the heart and cardiovascular system, you'll be interested to hear about the new research out of Massachusetts General Hospital, MIT, and Harvard. A total of 371,463 adults were examined for this project, with the median age being 57 years old. Average alcohol consumption on a weekly basis was 9.2 drinks in the sample. The data used here was originally collected for the UK Biobank. That's an ongoing biomedical database and research resource that collects in-depth genetic and health information. Similar to prior relevant studies, the research team initially noticed that moderate drinkers tend to show lower rates of heart disease. Okay, all good so far. People who avoided drinking altogether were more likely to develop heart disease, but heavy drinkers were the most at risk group by a wide margin. Importantly, though, moderate drinkers were also living much healthier lives in general than any of the other participants, even those abstaining from alcohol altogether. These folks typically reported exercising more, eating more vegetables, and less smoking. When researchers included such lifestyle factors into their calculations, any cardiovascular benefits tied specifically to moderate alcohol consumption essentially disappeared. Whoops! When genetic samples were taken and analyzed from patients, the results indicated subjects with genetic variants predicting higher alcohol consumption were more likely to drink more alcohol as well as more likely to have or develop hypertension and coronary artery disease. The study reports both men and women can potentially put themselves at greater risk of heart issues depending on their alcohol habits. Small risk increases were noticed while shifting from a zero to seven drinks per week level Meanwhile, much higher risk increases were seen while progressing from 7 to 14 drinks per week, and even higher risk profiles among both genders were recorded when consuming 21 or more drinks on a weekly basis. The findings even suggest levels of alcohol consumption currently deemed low risk by the U.S. Department of Agriculture. That's less than two drinks daily for men and one drink daily for women can raise your risk of heart problems. All in all, the study finds we should probably do our best to avoid alcohol altogether. If you drink a few alcoholic beverages per week, try to cut back. But the ideal solution is to put down the bottle altogether by their indications. Research also suggests that the relationship between alcohol consumption and heart health is exponential, not linear. In other words, people who drink a lot stand to benefit more from a cardiovascular perspective by lowering their intake than moderate drinkers. Check out more detail in the link in the description below on this and other studies at studyfinds.com.